What's up, Peak Timers? Phil here from Peak Time Racing. Welcome to today's video. And I've had all these brand new Hot Wheels just kind of sitting here and I'm waiting to open them up. And I thought, what not better way to do it than just open them up with you guys and then let's immediately race them to find out which one is the fastest. We've got the Demon, we've got the new color of the 720S. Uh, oh my god, there's just so many good ones. Okay, so uh, these are all ones that I've gotten uh, recently in my P case as well as ones that I've collected uh, kind of in the past week or two. So there's going to be lots of good ones here. Let's flip the camera on over here so you guys can see. Flip it on over. There you go. Sorry about the little uh, light reflection here, but we'll get opening up that one right away. So there they all are right now, and I've got one bonus one that I'll show you right at the end. Uh, let's start at this one right here since we'll get that reflection out of the way. And this one is the brand new, oop, we're dropping ones here. We're dropping ones here. We'll put that one down. Uh, this is the brand new Tesla Model X, brand new color variation, color variation of the Tesla Model X. And this one, I really, really like this casting when it first came out, came out in the white first, then it came out in the red. Uh, but let's go ahead and pop this one open. And we're gonna put this onto the tournament board. That's where we're doing the unboxing. So there is the Tesla Model X, got the nice Tesla energy on the side of it there. And this one is, it kind of looked black in the package, but now that we opened up, it's more of like a sparkly grayish color. Pretty, pretty cool casting. I really like the, the wheels look really good on it. It's a very nice one. All right, we'll put that one down. And you know what, since this one dropped right here, we'll go right to this one as well. This is the brand new color of the McLaren P1. And this is the green color variation. It's got those gray wheels on it. Check that out, beautiful looking new casting. Let's go ahead and pop this one open. There it is. Check that one out. Check out that green color. Wow, that looks so cool. Love it, love the stripe on there. That's very similar to the white one that they recently came out with, with that uh, front stripe on there. But the P1, one of my favorite castings, and check it out, it's even in race mode. It's got the uh, spoiler all up right there. Looks absolutely fantastic, a great looking car. That's car number two. Uh, let's go over here. We've got the brand new color of the Bone Shaker. This is one of the 50th anniversary packaging on there. So it's kind of odd that they came out with a different color. They've got all the, here, I've got it right beside me here. There's the blue one from the 50th anniversary set. So it's that matte blue. And now we've got this, uh, it's kind of like a matte red or it's like almost like a copperish red color. Uh, let's go ahead and pop this one open though. Here we go. Those new 50th anniversary wheels, got the number one on there for the set of 10 of the 50th anniversary cars. And now that I open it up, it's not really a matte finish, it's more of a glossy finish to it. So it's kind of a glossy red color to it. Kind of like that one, interesting, very, very interesting. There we go, bone shaker, shaking bones it is. Uh, all right, we'll go pop on over here. Um, this is the 52 Chevy, brand new color variation of the 52 Chevy. What do you guys think of this one? Like that, like that. Lots of the new trucks are becoming very popular. A lot of people loving the new trucks. So we'll go ahead, we'll pop that one open. Uh, yes, I found the ultimate bone shaker before as well. There we go. Uh, there is that nice matte finish. This is a very matte black, like a super, super matte finish to it. And on the side it says uh, Hot Wheels something. It's so small, I can hardly read with exactly what it says. But uh, this one is a uh, pretty neat casting if you're liking in the trucks, the low rider type of truck. We'll put that one down. Hello from Finland. What's up, Finland? How's it going? Thanks for joining in. Uh, there we go, Morris Mini. Morris Mini. Very, very nice. The new little outlaw casting on there. Uh, Magnus Walker variation. Let's go ahead and open him up. Very, very small casting, but uh, I like these new minis. There's all different types of uh, color variations for the new minis and the old minis. And this one, you can see that big engine in the back right there. Awesome, awesome. Check it out. Check out those gray mesh wheels on it too. Very, very cool. It's got the little dual exhaust in the back of it as well. It's an interesting one. All right, we'll put that one down. Smash that thumbs up, guys, if you're just joining in. Thanks for all the thumbs up and the love for the unboxings. Uh, let's head on over to the 2018 Ford Mustang GT red color variation. We saw this one in a blue variation before. Now we get the red colored variation. So we've got that one. Let's go ahead and pop that one open. This is a brand new one I just got yesterday. Most of these ones actually just got yesterday in the P case. Uh, there it is, red with the black wheels on there, all nicely blacked out, that black striping, very classic Mustang look to it. There we go, check it out, check out the black big striping on the back of it. Awesome, awesome. 
Very, very cool. Look at the back of it. Very clean. I like the, the look of the new Mustang is just so awesome. It's such a nice, clean look to it. They really cleaned up the car, making it look really good. All right. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Smash that thumbs up again if you're joining in. I see lots of people around today. And this is a brand new one that I got. Actually, uh, where did I get this one? I think I either found this one or it got sent to me. I can't remember exactly. But this is the Zamac Mustang, and it's the 67 Mustang from the Then and Now series, Zamac Edition. There we are. Hello from Canada. Hello back to you from Canada. Uh, there we go. Let's open the Zamac Mustang up. Very nice. Oh, I love all, all the new Zamac cars. I'm really looking forward to getting the Zamac McLaren P1. I haven't got that one yet, but check out the check out the lights just shining on that Zamac there. And this one's got some like black wheels with the gold trim lip on there. What's up, Brazil? There we go. Thank you very much, guys. Check it out. Check it out. It looks really, really nice. Zamac Mustang. All right, how many cars do I have out here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We got seven cars on this side. We'll put the brand new Ford GT race in black over on that side the rest of them will go on the other side for our tournament and this one 2016 Ford GT race black colored variation with the blue bottom uh, there's so many different color variations of the Ford GT race and I love it it's one of my favorite castings um, very very nice check out that big rear spoiler and check out the diffuser on there wow it's just ginormous and there is that very nice looking blue bottom we don't really see that very often but uh, the black with the blue looks fantastic. Some great tempo work on the front of it as well with the number 22. Great looking casting. I love this one. I love this one. Very, very nice. Uh, what's up, <laughs> Diecast Cars Garage? How's it going? Notification Squad, thanks for tuning in. Uh, smash that thumbs up, guys, if you're just joining in. There we go. We've got the green Porsche 934 Turbo RSR. Check that one out. Wow, I, I didn't even actually remember that this was in the P-Case. I opened up my P-Case and I'm like, wow, look at this car. Amazing looking casting. Let's open this one up. And this one they had in the uh, the then and now whites before, but check out that green. The Hot Wheels really loving the green. They got the green P1, they got this one. Uh, lots of new green cars coming up. And if you're a green car fan, this one is just perfect. Check it out. Check out the wide body on the back of that. Wow, that is so cool, so cool. Black wheels with the chrome lip on there. That green is amazing looking. And you know what, let's not stop at the Porsches there. Let's go ahead and do this one. There we go, we've got the Porsche 918 Spider. Check it out, 918 red with the black interior. And I actually already have one of these open up, but I got another one and I was like, oh, let's just open it up. We have to open it up. We have to open it. I know guys, the demon is coming. I cannot wait for that one. There we go, red 918, black interior. Got those really, really nice wheels on there. This is such a good casting, such an important uh, improvement casting from the previous 918s. The previous 918s were the concept variation and finally they came out with the true actual stock 918 variation. You see that exhaust coming out the back right there. Very, very, very nice. Love this casting. One of the best castings this year. Gotta love it. And this one is a recolor casting. It is the Custom 67 Pontiac Firebird and this one with that open hood. And check it out. Check out the flames on that. Check out those flames. Gotta love those flames. Let's go ahead, pop that one open. There it is. And this one is a little bit heavier of a casting. I don't know why. Maybe it's just because the, the engine exposed there was a little bit more detail work. They made it a little bit heavier than normal cars and it's all chromed on the inside of it as well. And check out the tampo flames on the top there. Wow, this one is so cool. This one's better when I open it up actually. I'm more excited to see this one now. Check that one out, love it. Wow, okay, okay, we've seen enough of those ones. Here we go, here we go. This is another one that I've really, really been waiting for. This is the white McLaren 720S. And I'll be honest, I wasn't a huge fan of the initial color that the 720S came in. It was kind of that burnt orange color. I'm not a huge fan of the burnt orange. Uh, I prefer more of like a red or a yellow, but the white with the black wheels, amazing. And check out the artwork on there. That is like one of the most perfect looking cards I've ever seen. All right, let's go ahead and pop this one open. Yes, yes, I've been waiting for this to open this one. Check that one out. Check it out, white with the black wheels. I love how the black top is just kind of like a bubble top on there. Very, very nice, great, great looking casting. 
720s oh well I, I just i don't know what it is about white cars with black wheels and especially ones with the chrome lip on there they look awesome there's a couple of uh porsches they then announced series porsches they had that had the, the white with the black wheels just look fantastic and gotta love this 720s all right all right here we go we'll put that one aside and 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 should we should we should we let's let's hold off let's hold off on the deep no i'm just kidding I don't, I'm, I'm juking you guys it's all good here we go 2018 challenger srt demon Brand new casting. Oh my gosh, we've been waiting so long to open up this one. Let's go ahead and pop it on open. Here we go. The Demon. So much more. Oh, heavier for sure than the actual other Challengers. And check it out. It's got even the little Demon logo right there on the side. And then we've got that big Demon hood. And check out the wide body. The wide body look on it. So we've got those big fender flares on there. And this one is yellow with the black wheels. I think it's yellow. Yeah, it is yellow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's yellow. It's yellow. Gotta love it. Great, even look at the Tampa work on the back. Didn't even notice that. We've got some, even the black trim on the actual spoiler right there. Wow, this is a great looking casting. And this one, people were selling these on eBay for like $50 when they first came out. And I was like, okay, I'm not spending $50 just to get this car right away. And I waited for my PK, so finally I got it. And it is awesome. Gotta love the Demon. And we'll see how well that does on the racetrack. That's going to the racetrack right away. There we go. Oh, you got two demons already. You're lucky, Diecast Cars Garage. All right, here we go. We got the Corvette C7 Z06 new color variation. I think this is probably the fourth or fifth color variation of it. There we go, there we go. Oh, let's open this one up. They've come out with uh, already several different colors this year and last year of this, but uh, this one looks good. It looks, it's like the same sort of pinstriping as the black one, but uh, just in a different color variation. So it's even got those big chrome wheels staggered all on there. Great looking car though, great looking car. Love the Corvettes. I am a Corvette fan. Um, a lot of people always ask me, am I, am I Chevy, am I Ford, am I Dodge? Uh, I don't really like any specific one. I like models from the different manufacturers and I'm a big Corvette guy, I love Corvettes. So there it is, the Corvette, we're putting that right beside the Demon. So that one's gonna go, that's gonna be a good racing right there. All right, there we go, we got our last one to open up. It's the Volkswagen T2 pickup. Actually, there's one more after this, I juked you guys. One more after this, well, it's a surprise casting though. There it is, Volkswagen T2 pickup, new color variation. Let's go ahead and pop that one open. There we go. And this one's been a very popular casting and check out the detail work on there. So they're kind of making it look a little bit rustic, but I love the flatbed on there and, and these wheels, black wheels with a very, very defined white lip on there. Very, very nice. We've got the engine in the back right there. Very, very cool looking casting, a very nice recolor. And all right, so that's 15 cars. I've got one bonus car for you guys today. This was a request by actually San P. Uh, he posted it in a different live stream before. We've got a Mercedes 6x6. I know it's not Hot Wheels, it is Matchbox, but this is a brand new color variation for it that I, I just got a hold of. I've been waiting to open it up, and I thought, what better time to open up than a request from a peak timer? So let's do it. We've got the Mercedes 6x6. Love this casting. And Matchbox, uh, Matchbox has just been making so much better cars lately. The castings that they've been coming out with are just fantastic. And there is the 6x6, one of my favorite cars of all time. I just love this thing. It is an absolute beast. The extended G-Wagon 6x6. It is awesome. Check that out even aggressive looking from the front, but that six wheels on there. Let's compare this beside the Demon. There we go. There's the Demon and the six by six. You can see it's a little bit longer, but it is an absolute beast of a machine. All right, all right, all right. We'll put those ones down. I'm gonna actually pick the camera up. Looks like the Demon right here. It's already trying to actually start our tournament up. Uh, I'm gonna separate the cars all right here. And we'll see who's racing who. So it looks like the Demon's going to be facing off against the Corvette Z06. Ooh, that's going to be a fitting one. We've got the two Porsches going up against each other. So there's that side for the tournament is all set. This side, we'll split them up. So we've got the Ford GT Race versus the Zamac Mustang. We've got the Mustang GT versus the Mini Cooper. The Chevy Pickup versus the Bone Shaker. And we've got a Tesla Model X versus the P1. So there is that side. There is that side. Let's head on over. Let's take our first matchup. We'll take the P1 versus the Model X. 
There we go. We'll throw the P1 on that side, the Model X on this side. Let me know in the comments down below who do you guys think is going to win this race? Who's going to win? Is it going to be the P1? Is it going to be the Model X? Who is going to take it? Here we go. On your mark, get set, go. Oh, it's the Tesla that takes the win. Tesla Model X is our first winner. Moving on to our next round. There it is. We'll put the P1 back down there. We'll move on over to this side to get the Porsche matchup. The brand new 918 versus the recolored green turbo RSR. These are two fantastic looking castings. I gotta like these ones here. Here we go. What do you guys think? Who's gonna win? Is there gonna be a Porsche in the winner's circle in this one? Do you think a Porsche is gonna win this? I think so. I think so. I'm, I'm guessing that a Porsche is gonna win this one. Here we go. Unmark, get set, go. 918. Hybrid power takes the win. There it is. 918's moving on. You guys called it. Here we go. 918. And all I know is I called that there was going to be a Porsche winning that one. And I was right, wasn't I? There we go. All right, this side we're going. We've got the Bone Shaker versus the 52 Chevy. Who's going to take it? We'll put Bone Shaker on this side. 52 Chevy over here. Who do you think is going to take it? Bone Shaker or the Chevy? Bone Shaker. Chevy. Model X, Model X is already won. 52 Chevy, Bone Shaker. Oh, I think it's gonna be a close one. On your mark, get set, go. It is close, it's close, and it's the Bone Shaker that takes the win at the end, just edging out the 52 Chevy. 52 Chevy goes right there. Bone Shaker's going against the Tesla next round. Now we're moving on to the Firebird, the custom Firebird, and the 720S. Ooh, these are two great ones. 720S, one of my favorite new color variations. And this custom Firebird, I was a lot more impressed with it when I opened it up. That one is great looking. Here we go. On your mark, get set, go. Oh, it's close. It is very close, but it's the custom Firebird that takes the win. Wow, that was neck and neck. Uh, eliminating my nice McLaren 720S, that's okay. There we go, custom Firebird moves on. We'll move on over to this side. We've got uh, the Mini Cooper versus the Mustang. We'll put them there and there. Actually, you know what, let's switch the lanes up. Let's do, let's do a couple middle lanes here. Um, and actually, I'm gonna do the finish line or the starting line right here just so that I know it doesn't hit either car. Uh, who do you think's gonna take it? The Cooper or the Mustang? Mini Cooper or Mustang? Mini Cooper, Mini, ooh, Mini fans here. On your mark, get set, go. Oh, it's very close. Oh, the Mustang just gets ahead at the end. The Cooper was ahead almost the whole way. The Mustang's top speed took over and eliminates the Cooper. That was a very close race. Very, very nice one. All right, well, moving on over this side. And there they are. I think this is the matchup of the first round. The Demon versus the C706. Ooh, this is gonna be a close one, I think. First time the Demon has gone on the track. First time any of these cars have gone on the track for that matter. Who do you think's gonna take it? Is Demon gonna move on or will it be taken out by its rival, the Corvette? Demon or Corvette? C7 Corvette, C7 Z06. What do you think? What do you think? Demon, Demon. Ooh, we got the Demon fans in here. Demon fans, all right. Here we go. I'm gonna manually start it this time as well. On your mark, get set, go. Oh, the Corvette. Oh, the Corvette eliminates the Demon. It looked like the Demon jumped off the line, but the Corvette's top speed took over. I'm sorry, guys. It looks like the Corvette won. Demon is eliminated. Corvette will move on. Ooh, I know, I know. Look at that, my two of my favorite cars of this unboxing are eliminated, unfortunately, but we got still some great castings. This one especially, Ford versus Ford GT Race versus the Zamac Mustang. This is gonna be a great matchup right here. What do you guys think? The GT or the Mustang? GT or Mustang? GT or Mustang? Who do you think's gonna take it? GT? GT, all right, here we go. On your mark, get set, go. Oh, the Mustang, look at the Mustang accelerate ahead. Wow, this Mustang is quick. Either this is really quick or the Ford GT race is just really slow. I think the Mustang's just really quick. Look at that matchup. Mustang versus Mustang, old versus new. Uh, let's finish it up here for round number one. The 6x6 six six and the Volkswagen T2 pickup are only non-Hot Wheels here. 
the Matchbox Mercedes 6x6 request from Sam Pete. Thank you very much for the request. What do you guys think? Who is going to take this one? Who's going to take it? Who's going to take it? On your mark, get set, go! Oh, the 6x6 takes the win, eliminating the Volkswagen T2 6x6. A great car. We'll be moving on. Can the 6x6 take out the Hot Wheels and win this tournament? Let's find out. All right. We'll start over on this side this time. The Porsche 918 versus the Firebird. There it is. Firebird 918. And I believe those are both the lanes that they each won in as well. So that will be good. They're both in their fast lanes. Uh, who's going to take it? 918 or the Firebird? 918 or the Firebird? Ooh, lots of Firebirds here. Firebird, Firebird, Firebird. Where are all the Porsche fans? There's some 918 fans. There we go. We got you guys coming in. Here we go. On your mark, get set, go. Oh, it's close. Oh, very close. It's the 918 that takes the win. Woo, that was a very, very, very close one. 918 moves on, eliminating the Firebird. There it is. Uh, we'll move on over to this side. Tesla versus Bone Shaker. Can the big engine of the Bone Shaker beat out the electric powered Tesla Model X. Who do you think is gonna take this one? Who do you think is gonna take it? Tesla or Bone Shaker? Tesla or Bone Shaker? What do you guys think? Bone Shaker, Tesla, Bone Shaker, Tesla. Ooh, it's a close one. On your mark, get set, go. Tesla takes the win. Tesla was ahead the whole time. Holy, there we go, there we go. Here we are, here we are. Tesla is moving on. There we are, and we will go over to, let's go over to this one, Mustang versus Mustang. There we go. Here we are, Mustang versus Mustang. The GT versus the, uh, the Zamac edition. So Zamac, or is it gonna be the GT? Zamac or GT? Red Mustang, red, red, GT. Ooh, new versus old. Here we go, on your mark. Get set, go! Oh, it's the new Mustang. Or oh, sorry, sorry, the, the Zamac Mustang, the old one. The old one that takes the win. There we go. And that one is going right there. There we are. Zamac Mustang versus the Tesla. We've got the Red 918. And now we've got our last matchup of round number two. It is the Corvette. Ooh, Corvette. A little bit of crash right there. Corvette versus the 6x6. Corvette eliminated the Demon. 6x6 are only non-Hot Wheels in this tournament. Let's find out who is going to take this one. 6x6 or the C7 Corvette? What do you think? Z06 or 6x6? Z06 or 6x6? What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Here we go. On your mark. Get set. Go. Oh, that was very close, but it's a six by six. Looked like the C7 Z06 was catching up at the end, but it just was not enough track space. And it is the six by six that's gonna be taking on the 918, and it's gonna be the big engine power, ooh, the Tesla versus the Zamac Mustang. Tesla versus Zamac Mustang. And it looks like we're having some connection issues. There we go, reconnecting. We'll wait for this to reconnect here. Here we go, here we go. Reconnecting, reconnecting, I think it's going, it's good, it's good, we're good, we're good. Tesla or Mustang, what do you guys think? Tesla or Mustang? Tesla, Mustang. Tesla or Mustang, what do you guys think? Throw some comments down below. Is it gonna be the Zamac or is it going to be the Mustang? Zamac or Mustang? Zamac or Mustang, what do you guys think? Mustang, Tesla, Mustang? Ooh, this is gonna be a close matchup. On your mark, get set, go! Mustang it is, it is the Mustang. It is the Mustang. Zamac Mustang takes the win and is moving on to our final race. Zamac Mustang takes the win. And um, is can everyone hear me? Can everyone see me? I'm, uh, my connection is saying that I'm having connecting issues, but I think everyone is still there. Uh, what do you guys think? Six by six. Or is it gonna be the Porsche 918? Six by six or 918? Ooh, this is gonna be a close one. I don't even know who I want to win this one. There's such good cars. Put the six by six over there, 918 over here. What do you guys think? Six by six, 918? Six by six? 
Ooh, this is gonna be a close one. This is gonna be a close one. Here we go. On your mark, get set, go. Oh, it's the six by six that takes the win. There it is. The track is starting to get destroyed at the finish line, but that's okay. Six by six takes the win. And the six by six is going up against the Mustang. Six by six versus the Zamac Mustang. What do you guys think about that? Can the six by six, a non Hot Wheels car, take the win, eliminating the very cool looking Zamac? What do you guys think? All right, let's take them on here. We're gonna do, it's gonna be one winner takes all. One winner takes all here. And there we go. Mustang versus the six by six. All right, let's get some votes in. Mustang or six by six? Mustang or six by six? What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Ooh, this is gonna be close. This is gonna be close. Mercedes, Mustang, Mustang, six by six. Here we go. One race, winner takes all. On your mark. Get set, go! Mustang takes the win. Lane number two, eliminating the six by six. Mustang is your winner, Zamac Mustang. There it is, six by six goes over there. So Zamac Mustang, what do you guys think about that beautiful looking Zamac Mustang? But what do you guys think? What do you guys think about this? Should we put the Zamac Mustang against the champ? F-150 the champ. Should we put it against the champ? What do you guys think? Let's get some votes. Mustang Zamac versus the champ? Should we do it? One race? Should we do it? I think so, I think so, I think so. We had to do it. Oh, 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 look at this. The old champ is angry and we've got the new champ right here. F-150 the champ will go up against the Mustang. And to be fair, we have to do a best of three just to be fair, to give everyone an equal opportunity chance. So we'll switch the lanes up. Here we go, F-150, the champ could be eliminated right here by the Zamac Mustang. What do you guys think? Smash that thumbs up if you think the champ can get beat. Do you think the champ can get beat by the Mustang? Do you think the Mustang is gonna win? I think that Mustang has been really quick. It's gonna be a hard one here. Smash that thumbs up, guys. All right, here we go. On your mark, get set. Go! Oh, flipped over. We'll redo that one, we'll redo that one. We're gonna have to fix the finish line right here. Uh, we had a false start by the actual Mustang. That was a crazy race. All right, I'm gonna fix this track part right here. We're gonna fix this track part right here as well. Get this going here. Here we go, here we go. All right, all right. We're gonna give this one a fair chance. We're gonna redo that. Look at the Mustang flipped over. That was my bad on the actual starting line. Let's do it again. Mustang versus F-150. I'm gonna do it with the hand here so it's all fair and equal. What do you guys think? On your mark, get set, go. Oh, it's the F-150. Look at that, smashing out the actual Mustang. But we're gonna redo that one, switch the lanes. F-150 got the first race. What do you guys think? If you think F-150 is gonna stay the champion, smash that thumbs up button. We're at 59 likes. Let's see how many likes. How many of you guys think that the F-150 is gonna take this race and remain the champion? Smash that thumbs up. Look at all those thumbs up coming up. You guys are awesome. Smash those thumbs up, guys. All right, I don't know, I don't know. I think it's gonna be a hard one for the Mustang here. Here we go. On your mark, get set, go. Oh, it's closer this time, but it's still, F-150 a chance and he actually flies off the track, but he is gonna remain the champion here. We're gonna put the Zamac Mustang back there. F-150, the champ, is gonna go back up on its champ board right here. There it is, he's gonna remain the champ. But congratulations to the Zamac Mustang. Fantastic job today, check it out, very nice. Lots of great looking cars today. And I just wanna thank you guys there it is, there it is. Thank you very much for watching today's live stream and everyone for you that joined in. Make sure you guys are subscribed, turn your notifications on so you don't miss the next live stream. Thank you very much for watching. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.